Hello and welcome to Be, Do, Learn, Have, Live with myself, Dave, and Wendy. Hey, Wendy. Hi. How's it going? So today we're going to be talking about attaining some goals that are set. So, and in this respect, we're going to talk about Dave's goal that he set for himself a couple months ago. Yeah, I think so. Okay, so I'll let you talk about that then, because it's your goal. It was my goal. It was your goal. Okay. <laughs> One of my goals, I'm looking for different experiences in life and it came up that actually on my vision board I do have a picture of people diving underwater looking at coral reefs and the like. Not that I've ever done that before in my life, but anyway, I, I have that down as my vision as something that, you know what, I'm going to do that at some point. Well, looking into it to do that Yes, I can go to any place around the world, uh, but I'm not going to necessarily be able to hire rent the gear unless I can actually show that I'm a skilled diver. So it turned out that being midsummer, I'm like, okay, well, maybe this is something that, that I can crop up and set as a goal for myself. And then I did, and it sort of sits there on the back burner for me. And then I got speaking to it, and it's like, okay, this month I have, I go through uh, several different. Uh, goals. In fact, I'm actually with a program uh, with Raymond Aaron called uh, The Monthly Mentor. And through that, he has uh, a mainly program which he sets up where we have we goals. We can talk about that in a separate one. In a separate yeah. one. So we'll go into that. But anyway, I, I have this goal set up that I was going to learn how to scuba dive. And under that, I have a month to sort of set myself some variations on it. And I actually managed to, in this one month, get myself certified for open water. So that's mm -hmm. great. So I can now uh, go out and dive, technically, in theory, on my own, to 60 feet underwater, which is actually, doesn't sound much, but it's actually fairly deep. And that's where most uh, recreational diving's set to. Now, the reality is going through the program here, one, I would want to be with a buddy for lots of good reasons, the main one being safety. Uh, two is a little bit of enjoyment so that if I go down diving I can actually now speak to someone who's been there seen it and we can have a lot more stories about it and the other thing is is that I can now go and be a diver with a group of divers on either a diving holiday or at any resort where they do diving as an activity I can now prove that I can go and dive so I can rent the gear and go down there so Potentially, I will be doing that at some point in the near future. Mm. So we'll see, but that's now, awesome. My, my, my take on this is, um, yes, Dave needs a dive buddy, but it has never appealed to me at all. Uh, I, I sometimes feel I should always keep up with Dave and what he's doing, but in this particular instance, it's not for me, it's not my thing. I don't even like the, the idea of it. Um, yes, it's probably a comfort zone thing, but it just doesn't appeal to me in the slightest, so I'd, I'd I'm quite happy just to pass it by so I'm happy to go on vacations with him so you can do your diving but I'm not going to be going down I don't mind putting my face under with a snorkel but I I ain't going any lower than that so but anyway that that's my side of it anyway so um for me for goals I've actually got cracking on my book again my son and I are our son and I are writing a book about um an experience uh, a year as experience of um a, tr a transitional growth stage for him so we're working on a book at that right now and my coach from global mastermind has been kicking my butt to get me uh, working on it a bit better so i'm setting time aside now every other weekend for about three hours just to get some some chapters done so that's that's ticking along steadily so i'm looking at the end of december to get that sort of written up um so what else what else what have you been up to well, there's been lots of goals. Um, mm. There's been lots of other things. So, well, we won't get into the mainly too much here. But we can but, do about uh, our MMI thing. Our MMI, yes, with our group. Things. Yeah. Okay, so we have set ourselves up with a little group of essentially our family <laughs> and at this point <laughs> one, one other one other person. We're looking to get a few other people involved. <laughs> but we're looking to have the right people there's no point having uh, a meeting of minds where half the minds are mush oh. it's a bit that's not right. <laughs> having people not thinking in the same way or um, 
along the same mental path is not mm. going to benefit anybody uh, in the long term. Yeah. So, we, but we do have this weekly group and part of the weekly group now <coughs> is to check in on each other for our goals and say, well, what was your goal? Okay, what have you done? What steps have you taken mm -hmm. to progress? It's not about saying, well, you should have done this and you should have done this and you should have done this. And it's not about that. It's about being there to support one another, offer guidance, offer mm -hmm. um, help or even suggestions as to, well, what could be the next step? What's going on? Or even pointing out and saying, well, you haven't actually done much for your goal this week. What, what's going on? What's the reason yeah. why? And it, we can hear one another come out with our reasons, our excuses, excuses. for not doing it. Yeah. Or it could be that everything they're saying is completely valid, but what's been working on is the time has been taken such that the emphasis or the focus has been on one other task. Right. So one other task has been performed uh, a lot more aggressively than say mm -hmm. another one, which is also great because then we can appreciate, nod, uh, give the, the handshakes and the thumbs up to saying like, great job, ni nice one, good for that. And although we've only been doing this for a few weeks, yeah. it's, it's very interesting from my perspective to see how good and grateful it is from, from my perspective to say, okay, I'm actually achieving some goals and getting them done fairly quick. And as well as seeing everybody else in the group get more goals done than perhaps would regularly be done. Exactly. So we're sort of holding each other accountable for the, for the goals we've written down. And our, our two kids are in this group as well. Excuse the noise, the dog's walking around. Um, and they've actually get, getting stuff done because they know that on every Thursday that they that they um, they're going to be asked how how their goals are going, and it's it's good. So we can even at home we can just check in with each other. And our other friend who does the group with us is um, looks forward to it as well, actually, doesn't he? So he yes. came to the original MMI, MMI with both of us, and uh, was quite life changing for him. So he's really keen to get on and um, move forward with his growth as well. So. It's been a really, really good couple of weeks actually. So we've got a whole bunch of things written down that we want to try and achieve within uh, within the month. Um, and I've also printed off our spreadsheet for us all to have a look at at home, just so we can keep uh, on top of it. Because you, it's funny, I'm doing on a Thursday, then there's the weekend, and then, oh wait, there's Thursday again. So it's just a matter of trying to make sure everything gets, gets checked off too. So, but we're gonna talk about the the actual method of the whole goal setting um, on the next video, which is what Dave's picked up from Raymond Aaron. We're not going to explain too much because obviously it's like a, a propriety thing, but we'll certainly give a few ideas on what the what the program is involved. And it's actually, it's good. It covers a lot of bases too, doesn't it? Yep. Yeah. And I'm sure I will on the next video, but I will give it a thumbs up and suggest that everybody who's remotely interested in wanting to achieve something in their life should sign up with Raymond Aaron's monthly uh, mentor program. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's it's awesome. Anyway, with that, we will uh, give this one a rest. Thank you for watching. We will see you on the next one. Take bye care. Bye-bye.